Good morning! It is 7 a.m. in Tokyo, Japan, and today we are going to Tsukiji Market, which is a very short walk from our hotel. We are super excited. I don't really eat in the morning, but I will today because I've heard that it's amazing. I had recommendations from several people, including my cousin Patricia, who's been here, and she's a big fan of Japan and the culture, and she told me all of the cute little spots. So we're gonna go, we're gonna see how the locals carry on their business, we're gonna try every single thing. Well, we're gonna try a lot. And I'm gonna make this vlog kind of what I spent and ate at Tsukiji Market. So I'll keep that all on the record for you guys. Okay, let's go. We just got our morning coffee. And we didn't eat dinner yesterday no. to make sure that we have empty stomachs this morning. Yes, this is my mom. For those of you that are new to the vlog, <laughs> this is a mama bear right here and it's a but girl's trip to Japan. No, so Julia's mom. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay guys, we are here approaching the market. First impressions, it's very clean. Like there's literally no garbage on the ground organized. Oh my God, this is so cute. It's now 7.30 a.m. and there's people literally inside eating this. This is insane. I'm just, maybe I'm not used to eating raw meat or fish in the morning. There's little alleyways that are so cute. I can't wait to get lost in here. I'm literally just shocked. Like there's, we got here at 7.30 and there's not like a whole lot of products left. It was recommended to get here around seven. Our little coffee date kind of prolonged it. This looks amazing. Should we get one of those for, cause that looks really good. But it feels illegal to start off the day with that. So this right here, this mochi is 300 yen. Black sesame paste. This is also 300 yen. Cherry blossom flavor mochi. So we actually ended up getting eight mochis, six of the ones that were like pre-ready and then two of the strawberry ones. My mom has them in her bag. It totaled 2,200 yen. I'm not gonna try that first right now because it feels illegal to just like start my day off with a mochi. So I really just wanna eat something, like maybe some noodle soup, I don't know. We'll see what there is. Something with like protein. <laughs> Not, not just sugar, but look at all of this fresh produce. This is insane. This is matcha? He said that's a matcha. Wow, that's beautiful. I might be getting this. Is this matcha? Yes, inside. This is inside? Yeah. Oh, it's good? Yeah. The best? Okay. Now we are buying some matcha. Ready to eat scallops right here. I think you should try it. I just tried some of this and I must say I'm not the biggest fan, but um, it must be so good for you. They're so helpful here and just explaining every single thing. Seaweed. seaweed. Okay, let's try. Thank you. Seaweed. Mmm, that is so good. Trying some squid. I want some Japanese fish. Japanese, 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 Japanese. Not bad. Oh, we have the seaweed was really good, but like it's so nice. They're letting us try every single thing that's in these little packages. Wasabi, yes, I love wasabi. So this is what I just tried: the seaweed right here and the squid right here. Thank you. Good. Huh? Stingray? Oh no, I'm not gonna do that. No. It's to eat. Yeah. No. I can't do that. Yeah. This is really good though. I'm sorry. We're from the Bahamas. So we have a lot of stingrays and I love stingrays. <laughs> What's that? Oh, I don't know about that. Very, very interesting. We are now checking out. We got a lot of goodies. So I got a matcha. We got two wasabis. We got seaweed. We got sea urchin. And what is that that you got right there? Uh, on top of the sea urchin. No, that's uh, on the top. Anglerfish. Anglerfish. Okay. So let's see the total here of what it is. 5,960 yen for 
all of this stuff right here. Wow. Someone. Oh, wow. Look at the sushi knives, mom. Wow, so cute. Why do I want all of this right now? We are trying now one barbecue oyster, which is 1,000 yen. I'm not the biggest fan of oysters, but I feel like I'll try this one. I've had cooked oysters before and I like them way more than the raw ones. Okay, let's see what this tastes like. I think I just don't like oysters. <laughs> Honestly, if you are an oyster connoisseur, you'll probably love this. I thought I'd like the grilled one, but I just... Oh, I'm not an oyster girly. Mom, you try. I like oysters, but I like them fresh. So I'm not really sure how this will taste. Mm. Not bad, but let me put some uh, ponzu sauce or soy sauce. I like cocktail sauce on oysters. Mm. Mm. It was good, but I prefer fresh ones. Can't believe I just had an oyster after waking up and rolling out of bed. <laughs> Never done that one before. Never ever have just like eaten raw fish right after waking up. It's a little different feeling, but uh. <laughs> the sun is out. The day is beautiful. Oh my God, wasabi green peas. I need this. Mm. So oh, this good. One too. This is a peanut. Wasabi peanut? Yeah. Mm, they're so I good. Don't cry. <laughs> don't cry. Don't cry? Oh God. So spicy. Really? <laughs> it's not that spicy. It's good. I love it. So they have a little discount. We're gonna we're gonna do the three pack for a thousand yen. I have no idea what that is. Squid. Oh. Pressed squid. Okay. Look at this squid. Non-pressed squid. <laughs> the eel. I don't know if you can bring that, but I feel like it's fine because it's packaged, you know? If anything, we eat it <laughs> in security. <laughs> it's so nice because you literally walk by these little stations and they let you try every single thing. They are so beyond friendly here. We just bought three bags of the wasabi peas, some squid, and I think that's it. And it was 16.50 yen. This is what's in the bag. So yeah, three of these and then one squid. So right now we are lining up to Itadori Bekan. My cousin really recommended this place. She's been here before. She said it's some of the best tuna she's had in the world. And I mean, I can tell there's a lineup, so. Are you sending it to Patricia? So we are in line, I'm so excited. This is what I got. Got some spot shrimp because it's absolutely my favorite. It literally melts in your mouth. Then I got the medium fatty tuna and fatty tuna. And my mom got this bowl with tapico and sea urchin. We have a little miso soup. Me and my mom both don't really like sea urchin, at least the ones we've tried in the States. But I tried it here and I love it. And she also loves it. She just tried it in her bowl and she's like mm, it's actually good i feel like in the states they just don't prepare it right i i don't know what it is canada also first bite with some wasabi mm -hmm. wow look at you eating all this urchin mm. it's good I, I told you in the states they don't make it like that one thing i love is real wasabi here now we are trying the spot shrimp. Oh my god. That is crazy, you have to try it. You guys have to try the spot shrimp if you've never tried it. It's almost like gooey, but it almost like melts in your mouth. It's so good. I still can't believe I just ate sushi at 8 a.m. <laughs> the first thing I ate was sashimi. It's just such a weird feeling because like, I feel like in our culture, it's not something you eat right when you wake up. This is my weakness. This is absolutely my weakness. Matcha soft serve ice cream. Like, are you kidding me? Do they really need to put this right here? I kind of want some, but my mom's already kind of up ahead. Do I get some or do I not get some? That was about 9,850 yen. Yeah, it was, I think. For those two things, and a miso soup was included, and tea was as well. That's one thing I really like here is that miso is included in 
almost everything and they give you green tea which is like not that common in the states i feel like in vancouver it's more common but not really sure because i i live in vancouver now i just moved there yeah they have all of these things you can just pick at and try which is something that i love scallop string sardine i'm not a big fan of sardines though did you try the angler fish that you bought no. you can try it right there let's see her reaction good or no Fishy. Fishy? Well, it's angler fish. Oh gosh. Do you regret buying it? Dylan will love it. Uh, Dylan will love it. <laughs> Grilled ray. That's one thing I will never try is stingray. I knew you'd say never say never. Yeah, people say never say never. I just can't. I love them way too much. I do. They have just such cute stuff. Oh my god, look at the memo pad. My mom yesterday, we're at the store. She thought it's a shot glass. It's literally something that you pour water in and it plants. <laughs> it planned it something. Planned it? it was just in a really cute market. cup. <gasps> Look at the erasers. Eraser. Oh my God. Look at the erasers. I kind of want them just to put in my desk. Are you kidding me? I'm going to get this one and this one for my brother. I don't really write with a pencil, but they're just too cute to not do. Just like my Hello Kitty spoon yesterday. Uh, the erasers are 500 yen. The magnet that we bought for my grandma is 600 and the shot glass that my mom got is how much? A thousand? Look yeah. at that pretty one. The other one's really pretty too with the waves. No, the shot glass is 800. My bad. So the total of all those things, 3,100 yen. It's definitely getting more busy as we speak though. I'm very happy we came early. The hotel did recommend us to come at 7 a.m. So I'm very happy we ended up here at 7.30 because now the crowds are just, they're getting big. Walking around some more here. I'm the most excited to bring home gifts to my family, to my friends. Like Japan is just like such a cool place. So, and it's always nice to, to give gifts. I love giving gifts more than receiving, I would say. So many little alleyways. Eva the Explorer. This is the current situation, guys. <laughs> Scallop soy sauce. Raw crab. We're getting one more. Magnet from my grandma totaled 600 yen. Now my mom is buying some gemaisha, which is tea made of rice, and it's 1,296 yen. Yeah. <laughs> she loves it. I showed it to her at a sushi place in Vancouver. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Thank you, very good. <laughs> Just a moment. Apart from the price, I really wonder what is the difference in all of these strawberries because I do want to try them because the strawberries in Europe generally taste a lot different than the ones in the States or like North America in general. So she's saying this one's the highest rated one. This is second tier oh, version. Okay. Uh, the taste is for during the same. It's all high quality. Too. It's all high quality. Yeah. So uh, I wouldn't mind. Like the other ones, just as good. Too. Just as good. Some, I like the, the higher tier ones have a nice little bit more sweetness, yeah, sweetness sweet but they're all pretty sweet. Okay. Yeah. The color is what sold me. Thank you so much. Yeah. Nice. That looks good, the mango. 900 yen for these strawberries. Look at all of this beautiful ceramics. We are now going to try the strawberry mochi and matcha mochi that we bought earlier. So. Cheers, Mama! Cheers. Mm. Mm. Very jelly. Very jolly. That is different than I expected. Look at my lip. <laughs> I want to try the strawberry. Mmm. That strawberry. Holy crap. It tastes like Polish. Polish. No, but it doesn't taste like a strawberry. It tastes like that other fruit in Poland. What's it called? The pojomka. little pojomka. That's what it tastes like. The strawberry has like whipped strawberry cream in it. Mmm. Oh my god. I love the strawberry much more. The strawberry is better. The strawberry is better, and I love matcha. Like I love everything matcha, and I'm saying that. So if you ever come here, get the strawberry. That is actually insane. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little vlog. I'm gonna finish my matcha mochi and we are going back to the hotel but that is tsukiji market for you guys 
I had a lot of fun here. There's so much to do. You can literally stand here, walk around for hours and hours, but I do recommend getting here early. Also, a few blocks away, not even a few, one block away from the Tsukiji Market is this beautiful, beautiful temple. And before you enter any places like this, you have to wash your hands and rinse your mouth because this is a sacred area. The temple is called Tsukiji Hongwanji. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but it's very beautiful to see inside. And of course, my mom found the one cherry blossom tree and she's, she's running. <laughs> she's running. Eva on the hunt. <laughs> happy? Are you happy? <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're crying? Oh no! Oh no! Don't cry! Don't cry, Mama! Oh, so, oh my god! <laughs> it was my mom's dream to see a cherry blossom, but yeah, that is the vlog of Tsukiji Market. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.